I'll fix it. And my assistant, the Honey Bee. We're going to get you started playing the guitar. So, if you're going to learn technical stuff with classical music and that, all with the complicated things, not, not here. This is how to have fun with the guitar right away, play some music, and have something you can take around the campfire or something. So, you'll need a guitar first. Uh, this is a Ovation acoustic guitar. That's a, like a, I don't know what the name of it is to say. It's something we got at a yard sale, but any guitar that you can tune up uh, will work. If it'll tune, you can learn on it and play some music and have a lot of fun. So, what you need is to be able to tune it. And no matter what kind of guitar you get, uh, the easiest, quickest way to tune it. I got an Android phone here. I've got an app on it called G-Strings, and uh, it's really easy to help you tune your guitar. And there's an iPod, and what do you have? Guitar tuner. Guitar tuner on the iPod. Same thing, and there's, there's lots of these things you can get. Or you can go to the music store and buy a tuner, an electric tuner. So that's the quickest, easiest way to get into tuning your guitar. When you tune your guitar, you're going to need to know the names of your strings. And it starts from the big fat one here and goes down to the smallest one. So the fat one is an E, and it goes E, A, D, G, B, E. The way I remember that is putting words to it. Elephants ate donuts gratefully but eloquently. You can put any words you want to and make up your own whatever. That just works for me, so that's what I use. All right, so at first you might want to write down the names of your strings and put them in order like that and tape it right on your guitar or something so that you, if, it might be a while before you can memorize that. After you got that going, uh, you'll need a chord. So your first chord, you got to count up the frets. These are called frets. One, two, three. Push down the little string with whatever finger you want. And you're going to play these bottom four strings. You can do it with your thumb. Or you can do it with a pick. And you're ready to start playing. That is a cheap G chord. some more videos but we're going to get you going we're going to get you so you can play lots of music take your guitar and go around to the campfire or wherever you're going to go so we're going to make more videos how to do it the next one's going to be a two chord song and we'll go on from there so be sure to like our videos and uh, it's much easier to find us if you go ahead and subscribe so hit the subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one